vlog on. Good morning, everybody. This is Lee Toker for another episode of Daily Life. So I went out last night uh, with the Vancouver voiceover group. We're going to show a couple clips from that. During a week of this, things kind of fall apart a little bit here around the old homestead. Around the old homestead, yes, they do. I'm kind of a lazy dick today because, you know, it's Saturday. And on Saturdays, Lee's like to rest a little. So here's episode... Ding! 15 of Daily Life. Enjoy. Vlog on everybody, welcome to episode 15 of Daily Life. <laughs> uh, Lee Toker and uh, Daily Life. Uh, so, uh, analytics, uh, that's always the funnest part. I know that you love it the most. I know you don't, but it's curious for me as an artist when I look back. We'll get Siri to uh, tally up the scores. Hey Siri, you wanna tally up some scores for me? <laughs> You're an idiot then! 154 plus 104 plus 97 plus 47. Oh shoot, I gotta do it again. Stop that. Let me have a look. Here's what I found on the web for 154 plus 104 plus 97 plus 47. Shoot, I'm going to do it again. Stop that. There's a website for everything! Okay, let's try this again. 154. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> 154 plus 104 plus 97 plus 74 plus 71 plus 112 plus 90 plus 58 plus 88 plus 64 plus 62 plus 51 plus 29. The answer is 1054. 1054? All right. 1054. It was late yesterday when I uploaded yesterday's video and it's, and it's pretty early still. It's not even... 11 o'clock or 10 o'clock, 10 o'clock here uh, now, so uh, that's pretty good. We got 55, 55 views since yesterday, right? Uh, okay, so in today's episode, um, it's the weekend, first of all, right? It's the weekend. Nobody, you're probably not even watching this right now. You should be doing something else. Why are you watching this? A yeah, shout out to all the League of Super Evil fans. Every once in a while I do the and it's it's definitely Dr. Frog. I played Dr. Frog in the League of Super Evil. But the, and, that, and that character always got like beat up. He was always like squished or squashed or stretched or, or thrown into space. Thrown into space, if you can believe that. Please don't. I deserve this. His intentions were always trying to kill him, man! When I came up with the voice, it was like a cross between Ren Hoek from Ren and Stimpy and uh, Peter Lorre. Do you like me now, Rick? <laughs> uh, what's today? So today, uh, oh, first of all, let me uh, apologize for the little uh, short of, of the orchard. A picture that I did, the time lapse of the couple stills, it was really pixelated when I saw it played back. And the uh, the strum stick that I was using, I think I'm just gonna use found uh, free source music. It was so basically the mic, this was the microphone that I was using. Not even that microphone, it was this microphone. And it was terrible, so I opened up GarageBand and I put it on, um, I think I put it on male vocal. Uh, so it had a little bit of a reverb echo on it just to cover up any of the inadequacies. Well, the playing was inadequate, clearly. <laughs> tomorrow, I'm going to be teaching. So I'm going to be probably doing another lazy day tomorrow because I have to teach for, I teach for on the mic training. Uh, and I guess that's a plug for them, on the mic training. <laughs> 
Um, well, I might take some footage for any of the students that are there that allow me to take uh, footage of them, and maybe I'll include that in uh, the day after tomorrow's uh, webisode. Brrr. Last night, I went out with uh, the Vancouver VoiceOver Club, and we were supposed to go to Johnny Fox's, but then it, there was, wasn't was enough room there. Anyway, so, uh, so we ended up going to Boston Pizza. I haven't had carbs for a while, so I had a little mini pizza and the whole thing in my mouth and then I got immediately sleepy. We meet up once a month at a different place to talk about what we're doing and the projects that we're doing and some of the gigs that we've got in it and I took it upon myself to make little videos to promote the the the, uh, the Facebook group. Vancouver voiceover. Bing! So I film myself interviewing them and talking about those very topics, what they've done to advance their brand, new gigs they've got, and just to keep them inspired and to promote them in all the great endeavors that they're doing. Because that's what I didn't have when I was a young, fledgling artist, and so I'm in a position now where I can. But I didn't do it last night. There, It was a smaller group. Uh, I think there was only like 15 people there. And uh, it just didn't seem like the right space. But I did manage to have an interview with somebody new there. Uh, here's that little interview. Well, hello there. This is the uh, this is Lee Tokar here, and uh, and I'm here with Asia Batu. Asia Batu, and we are at Boston Pizza here for the Vancouver Voiceover Meetup. I think it's number six. Uh, it's I my first time. It's so your first yeah, time. I'm glad it came out. It feels like my first time every single time. Uh, and so uh, we have something in common. I just found out that you are in Plants vs Zombies: Garden Warfare 2. As was I, and I played one of the characters that I played. Uh, was was the pirate that hobbles around and like, oh, he's 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 and you play? I was a pirate on my shoulder at the oh. of this. So we have that in common, Garden Warfare. Oh, uh, who so says good. video games take people apart, and leave them on I their couches in basements? They need to like see people like us. I know that it brings people together. That's right. So us being out in the world has brought everybody together alone go. on their couches in their parents' basements. See, that's what we're doing. We're helpers. We're helping. Yes, we're helping. We're helping. It's a good cause. <laughs> well, it's nice you know, to meet you. Really yeah. Good. Okay, so this is Lee Tokar signing off, and uh, we'll see if we can get some more footage before my battery dies out. Okay, see ya. Bye. And I did manage to go around the table and got everybody to say a quick hello. The, the sound quality on this, I warn you now, is going to be not great. I am too lazy, because it's Saturday, to do the subtitling. Um, for those people who are having a hard time hearing it, listen! <laughs> so there's that, so let's see that. Alright, so this is the Well, the Bellinis here are lovely. <laughs> Hello! What is my motivation? What is, why is this in front of me? Whoa, hey, what's up? <laughs> Not much, man! Awesome, dude! <laughs> hey guys, have you seen my calculator? I think I lost it. Did you take the picture yet? Did you take it? <laughs> Wanna play a game? I'll rip your face off! <gasps> Something short and sweet, you are sweet. <laughs> <laughs> Why, hello there! I love you kids! <laughs> oh, I just love these guys. <laughs> oh yeah, it does. <laughs> and there's that. So, um... A big shout out to Vancouver VoiceOver Club. Once again, I will not be producing your video this time, but I will next time. I'm still in the middle of this challenge. And this is episode 15, by the way, so we're halfway through the 30-day challenge. So, yay! We made it halfway! Oh. <laughs> Anyway, everybody, thank you again for tuning in. I will be investigating, doing a little due diligence <laughs> on, uh, I'm doing my own sound effects now, on live streaming, the Facebook live stream. But until episode 16, this has been episode 15. So thank you for watching and staying tuned in and for your continued support. Have a great weekend and I will, uh, well, I guess I'll see you tomorrow. Lee Tokar, vlogging off. Us being out in the world
has brought everybody together alone on their couches in their parents' basements. See, that's what we're doing. We're helpers.